these workers could soon have a lot more tic tacs to toss in the trash because there's a big group of Democrats out there hoping to send Trump back to the golf course. And I'll tell you all about it tonight. It's Dune and Donkey style. Shadow for First, the soul of our nation. First up, a long one. First up on the donk sty, a new poll says that Bernie Sanders has overtaken Elizabeth Warren as the top candidate among college students. <laughs> Though, with college kids, Bernie's still trailing the independent ticket, Post Malone Vape Juice 2020. <laughs> this poll of college kids is not great for Mayor Pete, who comes in at just barely over 8% overall. So even though he's the youngest candidate, Mayor Pete isn't really vibing with the students. It might be because he has, as they say in the dorm, big RA energy. <laughs> all right, guys. All right. I know we're all having a lot of fun here, but rules are rules, and the rules allow us to have more fun because I've signed us up for a litter pickup fun run down at the lake. <laughs> Come on, I'll sing us over. If you're collegiate and you know it, make a friend. <laughs> if you... <laughs> Last night she wasn't <laughs> But if there's one candidate, if there's one candidate you think would appeal to college students, it's tech entrepreneur Andrew Yang, seen here vowing to protect his voters from the tickle monster. <laughs> Yang, it turns out, just opened a new office in New Hampshire and showed all the gravitas of the fun babysitter. That's right. <laughs> As a full service presidential candidate. First of all, first of all, he's doing whippets totally wrong, <laughs> is what I'm told by the bad people. <laughs> Second, as someone who's been to several HR training sessions, that is questionable office behavior. <laughs> Why are they kneeling? Why are they kneeling? Thankfully, a member of Yang's staff stepped in before he whipped out the mouth cream again. <laughs> okay, yes, thank you, thank you. Cooler heads prevailed. That, my friends, that, my friends, is the kind of leadership America needs. Finally, a man who knows where to draw the line. I am ready to endorse Big Coat Guy 2020. <laughs> We got a great show for you tonight. Pharrell Williams is here, but when we return, Donald Trump has lost a very important motor. Stick around.